Thank you, Jimmy. Okay, first thing, you two. Take the body, stick it in a trunk. Now, Jimmy, this looks to be a pretty domesticated house. That will lead me to believe that in the garage or under the sink you got a bunch of cleansers and cleaners and shit like that? Am I correct? Good. Now, what I need you two fellas to do is take those cleaning products and clean the inside of the car. I'm talking fast, fast, fast. You need to go in the back seat. Scoop up all those little pieces of brain and skull. Get it out of there. Wipe down the upholstery. Now, when it comes to upholstery, you don't need to be spick and span. You don't need to eat off it. Just give it a good once-over. What you got to take care of are the really messy parts. The pools of blood that have collected, you got to soak that shit up. Now, Jimmy, I need to raid your linen closet. I need blankets. I need comforters. I need quilts. I need bedspreads. The thicker the better, the darker the better. No whites. Can't use them. We need to camouflage the interior of the car. We're going to line the front seat and the back seats and the floorboards with the quilts and blankets. This way, if a cop stops us and starts sticking his big snout in the car, the subterfuge won't last. But at a glance, the car will appear to be normal. Jimmy, lead the way. Boys, get to work.